Welcome back to Friday Night Frenzy. Mother Nature didn't affect every game on the schedule tonight. It's a clash of seven and six teams on the hardwood. East Hampton and Southwick both looking to stay above 500. Josh Drum for the Rams drives and won. One more time, he puts it on his left, finishes through contact, giving the Rams a boost early on. Nice pass the other way from that basis to Trevor Cannon-Smith. Basis this time with the steal. He's going to take it the other way. Got daylight in front of him. Can't get the layup to fall, but Jake Redmond says, I got you. That one good. Some excited future Eagles and Rams getting loud in the house tonight. Providing the juice. Basis in the paint. Floater. Bucket. Count it. And then basis to Cannon Smith. Top of the key. Splash. Jake Redmond with a spin in the lane. Nifty move. Got it to go, but Josh Drum. Too much to handle, taking over on D. Gets the loose ball. He's gonna take that the remainder of the way. Looking around him, got it. With the left hand. One more time, then he picks one. No one's gonna catch him. Rolls it home, but basis one more time. Friendly roll off the glass. However, it would be the visitor, Southwick, coming out on top, 53-47. Big showdown in Springfield tonight. 10-1 East Hampton at 11-1 Pope Francis. Maeve Termal, have yourself a night. Gets the steal. Two on one. Isabella Meadows. Yes. Now it's Meadows' turn to jar it loose. And Termal, who takes it all the way. Pope Francis on the break early and often. She's hyped. Time for Ava Albano to get in on the action. Meadows, once again, this time on defense, finds a cutting Termal off the bounce pass. Cardinals all fired up early on. Watch this move coming up through three defenders. Number 23 rises, scoops it up and in. Looking like Jordan on two, three, 23. Nonetheless, for the Eagles, Sophia Faginski, Lauren Morse off balance. Got that one. But Pope who proved to be too much. Meadows on the crossover, goes left. Give it to me. Cards win by three, 47-44. They're 12 and one. Back in action on Monday. The Chickabee girls facing off against East Long Meadow last night. Picked this one up in the fourth quarter. Pacers up big. Ella Florence to Jalen Garvin Martin, up for Lauren Cross. Mid range, good. Cross now to Alana Smith for Blaze Mack in the paint. No good from downtown on this one, but Smith is there for the board and the bucket. Cross court pass from Mack to Sophia Guzman. Yes, Spartans now. Lorraine Lotier gets it to Victoria Carano in traffic. Friendly roll off the rim. Blaze Mack now with the steal. Nice vision up to Gianna Garcia. She says, I'll do the rest. A lot of Smith finishes with 22. Chicopee wins 64 to 30. Hamden Charter School of Science East hosting Gateway Regional on senior night. Gateway in transition. Tanaya Petman rejected. Sends it to another zip code. High five from Tracy Jagunwa. More defense. Pittman knocks it away. It's Denasia West. Lobs a bounce pass for Janaya Bolden. She lays it in. Once again on the breakout, Jaguna dribbles, pass to Bolden, layup, count it for Gateway. Alexi Bonenfat kicks to an open, Alexandra Herenshon, three. Defense coming now, off the inbound pass, Bolden, pick, layup, count it. Kadeja Hicks, the sophomore, fights through two defenders and the referees for our Western Mass News cameras. Bolden picks up pocket, takes it up the floor. No one's going to be able to stop. Number 11 friendly roll off the rim. The Wolves win a tight one, 40 to 37. They're up to nine and three. It's now time for our Friday night frenzy player of the week, but not before we show you a shout out to Holyoke. They knock off the Central Golden Eagles on Tuesday, 81-77. Snaps a 77, or pardon, a 50-game win streak for the Golden Eagles versus Western Mass competition.